So once we are done with all this coding, now let's try to run this code. So if you run this code, you have to run this index.jsp. So what you can say is you will see a property there. Uh, the property name is message and the value by default will be guessed. This is because this uh, hello starts is directly mapped with a, a class which is hello starts here. So this message is mapped with a field which is a message here. So if you can see there, so this message is linked with that. Since we have not called this hello starts by default, this message will be blank. Now since it is blank, it will it will assign a value which is guessed, okay? And then uh, you will see a text field there and a button. So once you click on a button, it will send a request to hello starts. Hello starts will call um, call a method which is execute. In this execute, we are assigning the value to message which is hello and the the data which is entered in the field. If you can observe, we are not using any method called as get parameter from the request object. It this variable here or this name here, username is directly getting mapped with this uh, with this variable name which is username, and this is done with the help of interceptors. Okay, so let's run this uh, run this app. So if you run this code, it will take some time for uh, if you are running the code for the first time. For me, I have already done that, so it will not it will not take much of a time. So you can see, by default, the value is guessed is because the message is empty. But what if I enter a name here? So if I say, let's say Rahul, and if I click on submit, there you can see we have hello Rahul. So how it's working? So your 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 click on clicking on this button which is submit, request is going to web.xml. From that request is going to stars.xml and from stars.xml you are fetching this result which is success and it is calling the same page which is index.jsp. So this is how we need to work out with the first application of stars2. So I hope you got a basic idea about stars2 example or demonstration. So thank you so much for watching and do subscribe for the further videos.